Namaste, grade 4 learners! Hello, young scientists! This is Teacher Rebecca, and welcome to another scientific episode of Grade 4 Science. Today's video lesson is about water cycle. Are you ready to learn more about it? Oh, I heard your excitement. So come on and join me to explore the water cycle. of water such as fresh water sea water and ground water so now let's have a short activity which titled where do I belong all you have to do is to identify the sources of water of each given bodies of water through a picture puzzle you only have 10 seconds to answer What was the video all about? Very good. The answer is water cycle. How does the water cycle moves? Excellent. The water cycle continuously moves up and down. Can you name the process of water cycle mentioned in the video? Very good. We have evaporation, condensation, and precipitation. Let's do an experiment. The title of our experiment is Where I Came From. And the materials needed are the following. Microwavable plastic ware, saucer, hot water, plastic cover or sheet, rubber band, and stone.
evaporation, condensation, and precipitation are process of water cycle. Water cycle is the movement of water that circulates between being liquid or water to water vapor and to being liquid to water again. Let's discuss more about the process of water cycle. Let's have first the evaporation. Evaporation is the process of turning liquid into vapor. Then, what is water vapor? Well, water vapor, it is one state of water within the hydrosphere that it can be produced from evaporation of boiling of liquid water or from the sublimation of ice. Ibig sabihin, ang evaporation ay nangyayari kapag ang isang liquid ay naging vapor or gas. Paano nangyayari ito? Kapag naiinitan ang isang liquid. Kaya kapag ang isang bagay ay basa, kahit hindi natin ito punasan, ito ay natutuyo. That is because the liquid change into water vapor in the process of evaporation. Next one is what we call condensation. Condensation is a process where water vapor becomes liquid and it will form clouds. Ibig sabihin, yung water vapor na gas ay magiging liquid, it's because of the cold temperature sa itaas na nagiging clouds. The third one is precipitation. Precipitation refers to water released from clouds in the form of rain. The clouds will release rain if it gets heavy. In other countries, precipitation is in the form of snow, hail, or sleet. We also have transpiration. It is the release of water from plant leaves. Ang ugat ng halaman ay sumisipsip ng tubig sa ilalim ng lupa at ibibigay ang nutrients sa stem at leaves. Ang ibang water ay mag-evaporate sa pamamagitan ng prosesong transpiration. So, when water falls as rain, water soaks into soil and roots absorb the water. And water moves up through the stem. And when this water from leaves gets heat, water vapor released from leaf. And water vapor forms clouds. And the cycle will repeat. Sum it up, when the sun heats up the liquid, it will become vapor in the process of evaporation. Then this water vapor will form clouds in the process of condensation. When the clouds get heavy, it will release rain, snow, hail, or sleet through the process of precipitation. And this cycle is what we call the water cycle. Identify the process involved on each picture. Very good. The answer is precipitation. Next picture. Very good. We have evaporation when drying clothes. And we also have condensation when the liquids coming from the clothes heats up by the sun and becomes water vapor. Then this water vapor will form clouds. Can you give me some situations that process of water cycle is involved? Well, that will be your task after watching this video. Complete the diagram by putting the given words on the right order in the process of water cycle. You have one minute to answer.
check your answer. For your last activity, complete the paragraph. Choose your answer inside the box. Check your answer. That's it for today's lesson. I hope that this video helped you to learn more about water cycle. Again, this is Teacher Rebecca. Signing off to another scientific episode of Free Force Science.